Well, can you believe it? High school hockey season is knocking at the doorstep. And then for Bemidji girls team, they open up their season at home tomorrow night, ready for a fresh start. Hockey season is back. And for the Bemidji girls team, they're itching to get on the ice for some game action. We're really excited to get back on the ice tomorrow and we've been working really hard for tryouts and preparing for our games. It also begins the second year for head coach Casey Ryerson and his staff who feel very confident in their approach. We're ready to rock and roll this year. We're, uh, we're comfortable with the choices we made and uh, captains and comfortable with the choices we made and in uh, practice plans, everything seems to be going right right now. And it started with change this offseason, focusing on skill and speed, even with a little help from a pair of BSU Beavers, Summer Thibodeau and Emma Terrace. It was super cool to have some higher level experience help us out with our way of game, and I think it's going to really help us throughout the season. Our goal is always to look up to them, and I mean, lots of us want to play college hockey, so for them to come in and show us what it takes and show us what we have to do in order to get better, so we really looked up to them. They're our role models. On the ice, four seniors return featuring J.C. Lally defensively and forward Hannah Eller, but a good chunk of this roster is still very young. They played against some high-level talent last year. Um, the wins column wasn't what we wanted it to be, but you know what, that's now they have a little bit more experience. Hopefully they can make it better this year. So with last year in the rear view mirror, the Jacks are ready for a fresh start this season. Push through and stay consistent through our whole games and our practices and play all three periods. This year is a new year, so we're gonna get better and we're gonna hopefully get a couple more wins than last year, and I think we can do it. I think we have potential. And that New Year starts tomorrow night. They host East Grand Fork, 7 p.m. at the BCA. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.